Linear regression is a statistical technique that shows how two variables are related and uh, it can be used to predict future value. We have a um, scatter chart where we have independent variable on the x-axis and dependent variable on the y-axis. If we swap out the total distance um, and change it to total calories and here you can see the values, the data points are scattered, right? Now if you add a trend line here and uh, like I said, the data points are scattered widely around the regression line. And um, linear regression is useful in calculating a straight line that specifies a mathematical relationship between two variables, right? It can be expressed mathematically as y equal to mx plus b. And uh, where um, y is the predicted value, in our case it is our uh, total distance. And m is the slope, it indicates how much y changes for every unit change in x. And x is the independent variable, in our case it is total steps, right? So um, the intercept is where the line crosses the y-axis, the value of y when x is 0. Let us try to swap out uh, to total distance, so that is what we want to predict. And the independent variable is x. Now that we have understood, we can also look at the regression line. This is the regression line. And it is again expressed mathematically as y equal to mx plus b. And uh, there is a mathematical relationship. So it will define a linear function between x and y variables that best showcases the relationship between the two. This is the report page and we have a slicer on the left month year which is coming from the calendar table and the second visual is a table visual so i just wanted to see uh, how our predicted values are compared to the original so there is a date total steps actual distance and predicted distance and also what is the residual the difference between the predicted value and actual value And in a short time, we have uh, created report pages. We understood what is line STS function. And we have created a report page. And uh, we have table and slicer and scatter matrix. And also we have kind of extended the concept and made it into a dynamic uh, prediction also. So I hope uh, this video will help you in understanding linear regression. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.